everyone so welcome back to my channel if you're new here welcome to my channel I'm Lucy and I do face painting and I do make makeup as well I what I do I take images off the internet and I try to recreate them as best as I can <laughs> so if you're new here please subscribe down below and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I upload my future and upcoming videos so in today's makeup look we're gonna do a dragon face painting type of look this is gonna be challenging and very fun for me yeah let's go into this makeup look <laughs> So I'm going to be using my Going Out Though palette and I'm going to be taking the shade, wait <laughs> I'm going to be taking the shade Hangover and the palette which is the black shade and I'm going to be doing the outlining first because that's what I find is best for me. So I'm just going to be drawing the outline and then obviously I'll go in with my Snazzaro face paints to fill in the whole entire look. So I'm just sitting in front of the camera now a lot closer. Ignore my acne and stuff, it is going away, but um, I'm just left with a few acne scars here and there, but my skin is pretty much doing okay, I suppose. <laughs> This is where it starts to get a lot complicated. The face part of the dragon I really struggled with. I did have to go over so many times and it didn't look right the way that I wanted it to. So you do see me do it quite a lot of times to try and figure out the actual shape the way that I wanted the actual face to look like. So yeah. <laughs> It's trial and error really when it comes to outlining the the way you want it to go with every look that you do. So I'm just trying my best to sort of try and replica the actual face of the actual dragon. But <laughs> it kept on mucking up quite a lot of times but in a bit you do see me doing the actual face a lot better and a lot more defined
always seem to find that the detailing is the best part throughout the looks that I do because once you do the detailing on the actual looks that's what brings the whole thing come together it's like I always do like outlining and stuff to start off when it comes to doing makeup and stuff and face painting because it gives a guideline of what I need to go off and what I need to do because if I didn't have the guidelines then I wouldn't have a clue what I'm doing <laughs> so the outlining for me is the best part because it shows me where I have to go and what I have to do so I just basically try my best when it comes to every look I'm just winging it as I go along because every makeup look that I do and every face paint is the first go of the actual look that I'm trying to attempt to do. For some reason, my when I was actually doing the outlining, for some reason my camera cut out, and I did like I did do like the clothes on there, and I did like do the dragon's tail. I don't know whether you could see that. Probably not. I know that's not going to probably show up. Uh, in my photos and stuff but I'll probably end up just doing just a centre photo of the dragon so now that I've finished with the outlining I'm gonna go in with my face paint and I'm gonna be doing a red dragon I don't want to do a red dragon red and black dragon should I do that? yeah so I'm gonna do a red and black dragon so I'm gonna be using my Snazzle with it. stuck. I'm gonna be using my Snazzle red paint and the black paint if I can find it. Then I'm gonna use my black one as well. I'm actually thinking about going in with pink for you. I don't know. Well, do I'll do the pink for you now after I've done all the red. If it doesn't look right, then I'll just go over the top of it with the black paint. So I'm gonna go off camera and finish off the rest of the red and I'll be back with you now. Right, so I finished with the red, with the filling in. I'm now gonna go in with the black face paint and I'm gonna do like all the, where I first started off with the outline in. I'm gonna go over that and obviously fill in like, you know, the areas in. So I'm gonna be using the black face paint. Right, so I'm gonna mix the red and the white to make the pink to do in beer. I'm gonna do that off camera quickly. Hey everyone! So the ending of the video I didn't record. All I was left to do mainly was fill in the 
belly of the dragon with the pink that I mixed with the red and the white paint and then I went over then with the black face paint to f fill in the detail of the the belly and ba basically the only thing I needed to do then was use the white face paint to do the fill in the eyes fill in the horns and fill in the claws of the dragon and this is the final result of after applying eyeshadow on top of the face paints for it to stand out a lot more thank you guys for watching so if you enjoyed the video please give it a huge thumbs up comment and share it with your family also if you love my videos and what i do please be sure to subscribe down below and turn on the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I upload my future and upcoming videos. And that's for it. I hope you enjoyed and I shall see you in my next video. Love you guys. Bye.